Eric Lima here. Eric Lima here. You're watching EML 77 TV, episode 174. Hope everyone had a great, great weekend. I want to thank three people. I want to thank, uh, I want to welcome back Robert Johns to the to my new this new channel here, and I explained to him what's been going on on this new channel, so he don't have to. So Robert Johns, uh, uh, please enjoy these videos um, that I make and uh, enjoy them at your leisure and. Uh, Thanks for uh, um, resubbing to my new channel. Also, I want to th also want to thank uh, Paul Man for explaining uh, Paul Man for explaining to me the Zach Gibson chant. And he says it's hilarious. It's funny. Like I first heard him, like, why did he take his shoes off, man? What was up with that? And uh, I thought they were trying to, you know. But then, but I'm glad Paul Man educated me on that. Uh, so. So if if I end up going to a live event and see Zach Gibson, I'm going to be the only one probably doing holding their shoe up. Going, if you hate Zach Gibson, shoes off. If you hate Zach Gibson, shoes off. And the post like, put your shoe back on. Your your feet smell, and so does he. You know, just like, so. <laughs> so uh, thank you, Paul, man, for that. And I want to thank you, Notorious Gaming, for giving me a bit of information um, about Kenny Omega. I you know I said according to reports, Kenny Omega has already signed with All Elite Wrestling. That is not the case. He is he's going to be a free agent February first. So, but with the Royal Rumble being a week before that, so who knows for sure. And uh, and back to Robert Johns. As far as Park Video is concerned, they will be coming back in July. Um, hopefully, uh, hopefully uh, with. Uh, Hopefully the Whale City Festival would, would live up to my expectations for next year, for this coming year as well. And I'm hoping that uh, everything is doing well. And plus, with the, my new Christmas gift, the uh, GoPro ball cap I have, hopefully some new adventures. You're going to probably see some new adventures down the road. Uh, once the weather breaks and everything else and uh, every, everything going on, I will uh, bring that to you and to everyone out there as well. So enjoy it. So enjoy, um, enjoy those videos when they come around. Now, uh, forgive me for looking like this. I'm trying to get ready for church, but I want to show one of my items I bought on eBay. The my Woolworth shirt. Now, Woolworth was a five and ten, uh, five and ten cent store, five and dime store, as they call it back in the day. Um, it used to be at our mall. Glad I work a long time ago. Um, it closed down in '97, I believe. The last item that I bought from there. Is the uh, Florida Marlins ball cap? Uh, I know the Marlins were huge back in the day, uh, in the 90s, because in the teal, the teal, purple, gray, they were the colors, and those the 90s. Look, look at Taco Bell back in the 90s. Um, I think the only Taco Bell left that looks like old school Taco Bell would be uh, the one in for Haven. So, yeah, that's the only one they haven't changed a dime, dang, darn thing yet. Over there. So here I am getting ready for church, so that's why I'm buttoning back up. And uh, that's one of the items I bought on eBay. I know I showed you uh, items the Kmart truck of ball cap, the Super Mario Brothers 3 controller that I have. And I got a couple of items that were uh, also that got I got in the mail from eBay. I wanted to sell an auction on eBay. Before eBay and Amazon, there were catalogs. And uh, it's the Great American Wish Book Sears catalog. Uh, I used to collect these when I was a kid growing up. And I still have the 88 version. This is the, this is the 89. This is 1989. So uh, I appreciate um, Rick who uh, was auctioning this off. So, Rick, thank you very much, sir. I, I do enjoy it. So my dad's like, you're not going to get any items off. I said, I know that, but it's a nostalgia thing, man. So I've always liked old school stuff. So this is the Great American Wish Book of 1989. So that's pretty good. And as Friday, uh, New Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe has been released. I ordered it on Amazon. I wasn't going to take a chance of getting it on GameStop or anything like that, just in case of the inclement winter weather comes around. I figured I'd get so I bought, I got this off Amazon. Pretty cool, uh, pretty cool game so far. I enjoy, uh, thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, you can play as Nabbit and you can play as Peachette, uh, Toadette, who becomes Peachette with the Super Crown. So it's pretty, pretty cool. So I'm really excited, and I got you know got to see. Uh, <laughs> I got to see King Bell in action. Hopefully, I can, you know, do a little get these thumbs and show you a little bit of it. So I figured I'd have a lot of fun with it. So, hope you guys, uh, if you guys have this, if you guys have this game, pick it up right now. You can play Super Mario Bros. U wherever you go. It's totally, totally awesome. Um, 
Let's see what else. What else is there? Um, let's see. You know, what I'm looking forward to, um, of course, I will be on vacation from um, the week of the um, the 17th of March, which is Pat, St. Patty's Day. That's going to be my na- uh, vacation. It's a that's a month and a half because February is the shortest month at 28 days, and usually, I know usually the winter um, the winter weather gets worse between towards the end of January, uh, a little towards the end later parts of January and into February because February usually gets worse and then March starts settling down a little bit and so but lately um, lately we did not don't have much of the white stuff as of late I'm not gonna mention the S word um, as you know uh, as you know the weird uh, the funny part about that whole you know the whole thing is the only time actually snow uh, I'll mention it it's the word snow you know it's it's New England of snow actually happened it was the week before Thanksgiving, but that was during the fall, not during the winter time. You know, that which is so so far this winter we didn't have a whole lot of a lot of snow. Uh, for me, that's a good thing because you work in retail, plus you work outside, and you're forced. You know, there'd be backbreaking days because of snow and everything else. And we're trying to you know budget hours, of course. That's why they cut my hours down, so to speak, from 26 to 25, and. Uh, and they got rid of a day for me, you know, Saturdays and Sundays I have off, which is a good thing, you know, you get the extra rest and you get the extra strength and you get back on your feet again. So, <clears throat> but I respect my bosses for, for, for that and they want to bu- budget hours. So they got to be very, very, you know, so far it's so good because the first 12 days of January we didn't have that much of the white stuff. And so I'm hoping that um, this trend will continue, so to speak. You know, they said, you know, they said we have, might have a few snowstorms here and there. <clears throat> we we're probably gonna we probably could have one major one and then that's it you know but like I said the good like I said there's some there's some silver linings always for the winter time uh, one is February short month it's gonna be 28 days this year that means 2020 is gonna be leap year next year is gonna be leap year I think <clears throat> was that last year was last year leap year for 29 days well <clears throat> anyway ladies regardless to, this year it will be 28 days. And I got my vacation coming up in March, so I'm really excited about that. And if I do have a vacation coming up, I'll probably sleep in for a lot, shut off my alarm clock, and say I am not coming in for a week. And then I'm going to do my thing. <clears throat> um, then I'm going to do my thing here on here on my channel and everything else. Just so you know, there'll be new thumbnails to my videos. Expect them real, real soon. I'm trying to figure out mismatch and all, all that, and take some pic- selfies of myself so I can, you know. Usually Photoshop is really, really cool. I got Paint.net on my computer, and that will come in handy for me. It's going to be awesomely great. So expect, expect new thumbnails pretty soon. <clears throat> expect a, expect the new thumbnails pretty soon. So that way um, there'll be a lot, you know, lots of changes are happening. You know, good changes I'm hoping. I know 2018 last year was a very rough year for a lot of folks, including myself. But you know now we're you know, but there's some good, there were good things that happened last year. Hopefully, more good things happen to me this year. It's going to be uh, it's going to the future is going to be bright. You know that's uh, I know a lot of things going on with the government shutdown and crap like that, and just you know with the stupid wall thing and everything else. But you know that's why I stay away from politics because politics drives everyone crazy. And that's why I don't talk about it on here. You know. So that's why I explain myself why I hate politics and just and that's my honest opinion. But you know I'll go out and vote still. But there's a lot of things going on in my life to worry about what the government's trying to do. But you know it is what it is. So uh, so I get to uh, you know you know I, I want to continue and do my thing on here and that's the uh, most important thing here on YouTube to be entertaining, to have fun, and to be informative at the same time about my life and about what's going on. Just doing my thing, you know. Yeah, I'm gonna have some haters and trolls down the road and all that, but you know, like I said, I'm gonna ignore them this year and just um, you know, erase their comments and block them if they if they get at, if they get way out of hand. But no, you know, I have to be an adult and just uh, you know do my thing and just that's the way it is, you know. That's the way it goes. Sometimes, yeah, <clears throat> sometimes I don't have the best life ever. I don't have a glamorous life and a, a life of gloriousness and wonderfulness. But sometimes. You gotta take, you know, take the good, take the bad. You get roll with the punches and do the thing, and that's what I'm here for. And uh, I want to be entertaining and just, lo- and just let you know what what has been going on, um, and all that. I'm hopefully, now there's rumor, uh, rumor has it that could, um, there like over the, over next weekend it could be some a little bit of 
snow in the forecast. So I don't know if this weekend I'm going to enjoy my day off, the days off, or you know, Monday I'll probably have to come in and shovel. Not this, not tomorrow, but next Monday I may have to come in and shovel a little bit. But you know, enough for sure. You know, and as I know, it's just ways off. It's days off. It could, could be. It, it could be turned out to nothing by the time we get there. It's been bouncing back and forth, flipping and flopping between, you know, who knows for sure. And um, I'm hoping that, uh, you know, good things happen. <clears throat> like I said before, it has not been, uh, it has been a, uh, a decent winter, you know, not much has happened. But like I said, it's still, <clears throat> technically we have about a little bit two months left of winter anyways, because uh, March 20th will begin spring. Technically, and um, <clears throat> and uh, maybe maybe uh, Mother Nature must be thinking, hey, you know, uh, these kids in New England need school. I'm not going to do that much damage to them and all that. And so, uh, yeah, who, who knows for sure um, what's been going? On. I know a lot. Of, you know, sometimes snow days mean extended uh, uh, extended snow uh, snow, extended school year for the kids. You know, I just hope it doesn't re- resort to having the kids have their summer vacation shortened up either. And that's the main thing. And I think if some of us adults, probably a good thing that uh, we don't have uh, we don't have school. But, you know, like I said, weird things have happened all around. So, uh, like I said, lots to look forward to in 2019. And the park videos, Robert Johns, don't worry about them. When the weather breaks into spring and summer, you're going to see a lot of them. Uh, you're going to see more and just uh, have a lot of fun. Um, also, when the spring and summer comes around, too, uh, expect a little bit of crazy man karaoke in the car as well when trying to get um, something to hold on to the... Um, <clears throat> something to uh, hold on to uh, the, the camera phones, too. <clears throat> or I can bring my GoPro cam and just do do the thing there and just have a lot of fun with it and just... Uh, <clears throat> So who knows for sure what's been going on? Who knows for sure what's going to go on? Let's say I got my new GoPro ball cap. It's going to be uh, that I have for Christmas. I'm looking forward to using it a little bit more. And who knows for sure what's going on? All right, that's all the time we have on the show. I hope you guys enjoyed the video as well. Of what's going on? Oh, also on Access TV. If you have Access TV, just so you know, if you're a wrestling fan, if you're a fan of the women's wrestling. Uh, Wild wow Superheroes will make their debut this Friday, 9, 8 Central, on Access TV. And it's going to be tough for you to either watch that and you can watch Impact Wrestling on Twitch. So I'll probably go between the two. Um, the lovely Tessa Blanchard will be there. I, I, I love Tessa Blanchard. I think she's not only beautiful and gorgeous, but she can wrestle just like her father and her grandfather and her stepdad. Uh, look out for her. Uh, some of the lady, uh, one of the... Uh, Alumni from the Mae Young Classic, Santana Garrett, is the champion of WOW Superheroes. So watch that. There's going to be a lot. It's, it's going to be a little bit of reminiscent of Glow a little bit. It's like a modern-day version of Glow, sort of. And But, you know, but it's a lot of fun to watch. So it'll, it'll be a lot of fun to watch. I saw a lot of previews of it and coming up. And uh, it'll be very interesting to see what happens down the road on that department. So, uh so watch the ep- premiere episode of Wow Superheroes this Friday night at 9, 8 central on Access TV. I have Access TV on my TV. Can't wait to watch it. Can't wait to watch it. So that's it. So um, that's it. That's all there is on the docket. I want to thank everyone for coming in and just um, I got to eat breakfast and get ready for church in about an hour or so. So I'm going to say God's blessings to you all. Have a great day. Peace, love, and catch you on the flip side. See ya. Have a good day. And watch out. Um, I'll come up with episode 175 and talk to you then. All right. See ya. Bye.